Hey, how's it going? Dylan here. Today we are taking a look at David Gordon Green's Halloween. All right, so Halloween. Halloween um, 2018, obviously, directed by David Gordon Green, starring Jamie Lee Curtis, Judy Greer, and a bunch of other really good actors and actresses. What can I say? Uh, Halloween itself, I'm not a massive fan. It's not my slasher. Uh, it's not mine. Um, obviously, a lot of people, in terms of slasher films, they either like Halloween, uh, Friday the 13th, or Nightmare on Elm Street, because um, they're like kind of the pillars, I guess you could say, of the, well, the, well, the original pillars. Halloween was never, was kind of always my third choice, to be honest with you. Uh, and I'm sorry if that offends you, because I know that a lot of people love Halloween out there. But Halloween was definitely always my last choice. I haven't seen any of the other sequels. Um, I've only seen the original, which I did enjoy. Um, I just liked the other two a little bit more. Uh, when I got the chance to go see the new one, Halloween, um, thanks to Universal Pictures Australia. Uh, thank you for inviting me along to the press screening very fun time. I was kind of excited because I, I saw some of the trailers and the buzz was getting really big uh, and I'm happy to report that I thoroughly enjoyed this film. It was really fun, uh, very nostalgic but also kind of something technically new and flipped some tropes on their heads uh, made by the original even. It was really nice. Let's get into it a little bit more. So obviously Halloween um, is a direct sequel to the original Halloween, uh, ignoring all the other sequels that come out in between. Uh, which uh, there are a lot in most slasher film franchises. And we find, obviously, uh, Laurie Strode, um, obviously having aged, but uh, kind of had a, had a daughter, and um, obviously they're kind of estranged, and she is always, always in fight-or-flight mode. She's prepared for the inevitable return of Michael. Um, and we get this really cool opening. So I was sitting in the cinema, and I'm thinking... You know, this film is starting out, it's kind of slow, you know, the usual, like, you know, he's in, he's incarcerated or whatever, and some people are going to interview him, and et cetera, et cetera, and it gets, it just kind of started to build, and the way it's shot, beautiful anamorphic cinematography, by the way, uh, kind of just builds and builds uh, until we get a crescendo, and then suddenly it cuts to the Halloween intro and John Carpenter's uh, fantastically nostalgic score. Um, uh, boomed through the cinema speakers and I was instantly like, yep, I'm going to enjoy this um, from that in instant moment. Um, it was really fantastic. And it kind of annoyed me, actually. Someone behind me was like, oh, these credits are so long. You know, who does that? That score was amazing. I loved the intro to that, f this film. Uh, and from there, it just got really good. I, I have a soft spot for most slasher films, but this one was really solid. Um, it had some interesting twists and turns here and there. Um, and really good performances all around, and a great performance by this little kid, uh, who I won't spoil it, but he, he really made the middle of the movie, he was the highlight of the centre of this film, and obviously there's probably going to be a sequel, there is an after credits thing in this film, not really a scene per se, but yeah, I really enjoyed it, um, I'm not going to say much more, uh, spoilers and things like that, and it is a slash film, there's not really much else to really say, um, apart from it's masterfully directed, Great score, great cinematography, um, and really looking forward to seeing what else David Gordon Green does in the future. He has such an interesting career and mishmash of movies. Thanks again to Universal for inviting me along. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you want to see more. Hit that bell button to be notified of new uploads as they become available. Hit me up in the t comments or on Twitter. Always open for a chat about film, TV, coffee, anything. And until next time, take very good care. <laughs>